Okay, this is question two of the 20, grade 11, 2022 paper, and it starts off like this. You see, when you have a square root times another square root, you can actually look at it as the square root of the whole thing. If you have a square root multiplied by a square root, the square root of a times the square root of b is equal to the square root of a times b right here. There's the story. And so it's 2 root 5, which is really root 20. That's going to make it this easier to do. Um, this 2 root 5 is really root 20, the square root of 4 times the square root of 5. And now you just do FOIL on this. Root 20 times root 20 is 20. And then plus root uh, 2 root 20 minus 2 root 20, that's 0. Minus 2 times 2 is minus 4. 20 minus 4 is 16, and the square root of 16 is 4. If you do this and write down 4 and don't show your work, they don't give you any marks. Okay, now the next question. Woo, this thing on the right. Uh, I did it this way first. Oh, and I thought, that's crazy. It's, but, and that's because I did it the hard way. What you have to do, you've got this bracket, x plus 1 over root x minus uh, root x. Well, what you need to do is to make the bottoms the same. Well, if we multiply root x by x, it'll, uh, sorry, root x by root x, it'll turn into x. Well, that's a common denominator. This is root x over 1, so we can multiply 1 by x. Now, there's our common denominator, top and bottom of this by root x. Top and bottom of this, we make it over 1 by x, and look what we get. We get x plus 1 times root x minus root x times x. Well, hey root x times x minus root x times x, that leaves, that leaves, oh no, hey, sorry, you've got, um, let's see what we have here, we have root x times 1, that gives you root x, and then you have root x times x minus root x times x, that cancels, all you're left with is the root x. Now this negative exponent is really 1 over this thing, uh, to the positive power. In fact, the negative, you can take this fraction and turn it upside down and go x divided by root x squared. But x squared is x squared, root x squared is x, x squared divided by x is just x. So that's your answer, x. Let's look at the last part of question two. Now this one, the key is, look at this 3 to the x right here. This 3 to the x is here. This 3 to the x is here. It's in everything. And all you have to do is factor it out. 3 to the x times 2 times 3 to the 1. That's, what, that's what's left here. If I go 3 to the x times 2 times 3, I get exactly this. And what's left here? 6 times 3 to the 1. What's left here? Well, just 3 to the 1. And 3 to the x times 1 gives me 3 to the x. Well, there you go. 3 to the x is cancel. And this is just a number. It's 6 minus 18, which is minus 12. And minus 12 divided by 4 equals your answer of negative 3. And there you go.